is not cheap to train these dogs. It takes about $20,000. And as we promised you yesterday, Sherry breaks down what you need to know before choosing one in this morning's My Pet. Hi, I'm Sherry with Service Dogs, Inc., and today we're going to talk about what you should do if you're interested in getting a service dog. The first step that most people take is to contact a reputable provider like Service Dogs, Inc. If you're not sure which groups are reputable, you can go to Assistance Dogs International's website and look for groups that are accredited like we are. They have a minimum standards for their training of the dogs and the people, so if they're accredited, you can be sure the group is reputable. Sometimes people want us to train a dog they already have, but that's very difficult, and most groups like us will not do it. We spend a lot of time temperament testing dogs like Domino at animal shelters throughout Texas. We only pick one out of every 300 dogs we see that have the best temperament for this kind of work. So if you already have your own dog, it may not quite have the right temperament to be a professional working dog. The next thing is that we train the dog completely for free. If you have your own dog, you're going to have to get a private trainer and they can charge up to $100 an hour. This kind of training takes the better part of a year, and that doesn't even count the follow-up that groups like us provide for the lifetime of the dog. We exist entirely on donations, so gifts and proceeds from the Mighty Texas Dog Walk fund the $20,000 it takes to turn a stray like Domino into a star and your best friend. If you do want to get your own trainer, let them help you pick out the dog. They may have a lot more experience than you do on picking a dog with the right temperament for this kind of work. So even that dog that you can't resist might not be the best dog for the purpose that you want to use it for. For more tips on training service dogs, check us out on KXAN.com.